what is black box testing okay so black box testing is the input output driven testing okay it's a black box as the name itself says a black box now when i say go ahead and test a phone i give you a, an iphone or an android phone go ahead and test it right so what you will do you will go ahead and turn it on first thing if it is turned off go ahead turn it on you will see whether it's turning on or on on or not right so once it's turned on successfully you will go ahead with the registration the the overall customer registration process or login process and then going ahead and seeing that yes you can insert the the sim card you are able to make the call receive the call send the text messages once the sim card is inserted or not you are able to connect to the wi-fi and browse the internet open the the uh, the browser and go ahead and browse the internet or not these are some of the very high level testing that you will do now do you know or do you have any visibility what happens in the background when you press that button the the turn on button the power on button right you don't know anything what happens in the background when you press the button so internal working of that particular phone is a black box to you right you only know the button you have pressed on you know that this is the power button it will power on the phone so when you do not worry you do not know what happens inside the phone when somebody presses the power on button when somebody opens the browser when somebody connects to internet and then browses the internet internally what happens what signal is uh, being triggered what all network connectivity happens when you you are not bothered or worried about any of that that is black box testing right so black box testing is concerned about what software does and not how it does you are not concerned about how that powering on happened how the battery is providing the power right how the connectivity happens you are not bothered about that you are just bothered bothered about the functionality so it's a black box to you in the software to testing context software context is the same thing you are testing a say for example e-commerce website okay so you will go ahead and open the website you will click on register button you will provide all the details click on register button you will see that registration has been successful right you are not bothered how the internal code works when somebody submits the registration form okay how many methods are called how which statements have been executed or not so that's what the black box testing is when you are not bothered about any of the internal workings of the software and in the black box testing you are testing both functional and non-functional aspects characteristics of the software and black box testing is dynamic testing technique when we say functional and non-functional functionality is registration function non-functional aspect of the same functionality is how quickly the customer gets the response back when he clicks on register button that's the non-functional characteristics right i'll cover in more detail in upcoming questions about non-functional characteristics and functional characteristics as well so that's what the black box testing is all about